Director's Reflection for October 24th of 2021. Quality and Innovation. Many wonder what is the key to success. In its print and digital formats of the New York Times and David Robin, its chief strategist, doesn't blink to say it, quality and innovation. Combining a careful commitment to the quality of its content with in-depth analysis, reports and process and contextualized data, the printed New York Times marks distance and amplifies its subscriber base with 8 million. Although the great blow of its upward curve was achieved during the first year of the pandemic, thanks to a continuous and live tracking of cases, adding 2 million subscribers, as Robin said in a panel of the 77th General Assembly of the Inter-American Press Association. The auction was reached by incorporating the latest technologies of artificial intelligence. In this case, technological innovation represented the driving force that has allowed the times to rise as a paradigm of transformation in this new era of communications. With artificial intelligence, newspapers improved their news editing process, content creation, a marketing mechanism, subscriptions and closer ties with the preferences and tastes of their customers or users. Its costs, at the moment, are high and that is why it has not had a more widespread application in Latin America. The search for quality is already understood at the traditional media level as the alternative to the fake news crisis and the manipulations that have undermined the news model, greatly damaging the credibility of digital media. The void that arises from this mistrust is what has triggered the alarms of professional, ethical and responsible journalism to produce content adjusted to the truth and reality, but with the added values provided by the stylus of data process with the technology of the artificial intelligence. Discovering angles and novel aspects of a story. It is not so difficult to take the path of quality, but if it is not accompanied by technology, the formula for success of the New York Times would not be completed. The later continues to be the greatest stumbling block for many Latin American media that want to soar and gain more audiences and generate more income to ensure a long and sustainable survival. For Listing Diario, voiceover and translations by Indira Rodriguez.